Yo oh man, what do you do YouTube? It's your boy Shuno coming at you with another banger man. So look in this video, bro, I'm coming at y'all with the best new VC glitch in the game. You know what I'm saying, bro? This is the most game-breaking VC glitch. You know what I'm saying? So look, y'all gotta run this up before it gets passed. You know what I'm saying? But look, I need y'all help, bro. I'm trying to hit 1k as soon as possible, you know what I'm saying? So look, drop a like and sub, but you know what I'm saying? Help your way out and grind it. You know what I'm saying? So without further ado, let's Alright, so for the first method that we have is the trendsetter method. With this method, you can make up to 10,000 VC an hour or even 20,000, depending on how you play it. So, the first thing you want to do is just head over to my team. You can easily make 10,000 as I stated before. So, all you want to do is just head over to my team. And essentially, all you want to do is head to unopened packs. And once you head over to the unopened packs, um, mine is the season two. So all you want to do is just head over there and all you got to do is just claim that unopened pack. Not too many people know about this um, little method slash pack rewards card, but you could really take advantage of it. And all you really got to do is just exchange it and um, yeah, just collect that card. And then as soon as you get that card, you should get up to 10,000 VC. Watch. All right, so as y'all can see, I'm opening the season two transgender rewards card. And as you guys can see, my VC went up 10,000. I now officially have 201,000 VC, as y'all can see up there in the top right corner. You see, this is just a small little pack rewards card. But now let's get into the step two. Step two, it comes with a little bonus. You can make up to 20, you know, 1,000 VC an hour with this as well. And basically it's pretty simple and i'm about to give y'all the quick little step-by-step -step guide on how to do this one so all you guys want to do is just look on the map and try to find the sunset part so once you find that sunset part all you want to do is just head over to there you know what i'm saying it shouldn't take you too long who knows but all you want to do is go to the street ball weekly stats um challenge you see the rewards you can get up to 3000 vc every single day not too many people know about this so like you really want to take advantage of it you could pretty much just pick whoever you want all you really have to do is just dominate the whole game which should be easy because come on let's be for real you know what i'm saying like lock in so all you want to do when you get inside the game is really just take over and you want to get your lead meter all the way up so you can win and get those rewards and yeah like you could really use this method every single day you just have to take advantage of it and not too many people know that this re reward is actually available so all you want to do is just do that you know kill them boys out there dominate the whole game throw lobs you know you know like take over you know what i'm saying but yeah so once you um you know go through the whole thing dominate the whole thing um you should be able to get this reward and you can do this every day so you can get some new drip some new clothes um you know what i'm saying uh upgrade your player because i don't know what it is but 2k does not want to give out no more vc to nobody no more which is crazy so yeah all you want to do is just you know dominate the whole game play the whole game but um preferably you want to try to throw lobs and stuff like that to get extra vc so you can get more than what you're already getting and you can somewhat upgrade your badges in this mode and yeah sunset park this is method number two you know what i'm saying you can see the whole crowd going wild right there you know shut it down going crazy man so as soon as you guys are done with the game you guys should get your attributes up your points up and you should get a quick extra vc so that's why i say you should throw more lives you know some more fans and more team chemistry as y'all and as y'all guys can see y'all see me keep doing the same thing just keep running up this method you could do this method every single day and sometimes they might let let you do even more in one day which is honestly crazy because it's like you know like people don't really know that because people don't really check 
so you want to make sure that you're actually checking and actually you know like you know just check man and trust me it should be there all the time and as y'all can see you know shut it down again you always want to make sure that you actually win so you can get some actually uh more vc and um yeah throw lobs for your badges and attributes and skill levels and fans and uh yeah as y'all boys can see a plus grade you know some of my points is going up everything this method literally helps you with hella vc um badges and attributes this is literally a win-win for literally everybody get more fans and stuff like that and the vc should be coming in as y'all can see you know what i'm saying but um the prices should fluctuate um but mainly is 3000 vc every single time and you could do this more than one time in a day but most time is one time of the day. As you guys can see, I just gave y'all two quick step-by-step -step methods on how to get some VC. Um, I may drop some more methods in the future, who knows? And I might even drop some badge glitches for y'all. Um, you know, I just wanna help y'all out. But without further ado, like the video and subscribe. I'm Road to 10K and I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one.